Tucked away in the Missouri River Valley, Herman is a picture book 19th century village. Because the terrain was too steep for farming, the original German settlers planted vineyards throughout the village on the banks of the Missouri River, which reminded them of their homeland. By the turn of the century, Herman became one of the world's leading wine-producing regions. When Prohibition came, the town was devastated. However, today you can enjoy old-world hospitality and the quiet charms of an earlier era. Taste and tour world-class wineries. Shop and stroll the historic districts. Bike, hike, or run Missouri's Katy Trail. Or just sit back, relax, and be mesmerized by the beautiful landscape that is Herman and wonder, is that the Missouri River or could it be the Rhine? The Katy Trail is a 225-mile bike trail that stretches across most of the state of Missouri. Over half of it follows the path taken by Lewis and Clark up the Missouri River. You can ride beneath towering river bluffs along the river to peaceful farmland and small-town Americana. Riders come from all over to enjoy this unique experience. Herman is only three miles from the trail and is a popular destination because of its charm and character. Herman is the perfect getaway in the heart of Missouri wine country. Nestled along the Missouri River, you can discover wonderful family-owned wineries. Perched dramatically on a hill overlooking the beautiful German town of Herman, Stone Hill Winery and Restaurant is one of the most popular tourist attractions in Missouri wine country. Listed on the National Register of Historic Places, Stone Hill produces world-class wines, winning more than 2,700 awards since 1993. After a guided tour of the underground wine cellars, guests may sample award-winning wines and browse the winery's spacious gift shop before enjoying a relaxing lunch or dinner in the adjacent vintage restaurant that specializes in German cuisine. Adam Puchta Winery is the oldest continuously owned family farm winery in Missouri. Established in 1855, you're invited to explore an authentic farm winery just two miles from Herman. The original homestead today houses the gift shop and tasting room. Tucked high and away on the Missouri River bluffs, Oak Glen offers a breathtaking countryside view. From your perch atop the bluff, you can enjoy a glass of fine wine while viewing a section of the Missouri River that Lewis and Clark explored on their expedition. The George Hussman Wine Pavilion is open daily and offers a large selection of premium wines. Live entertainment is presented on Saturdays during the summer and fall. Hermannhof Winery, with a proud German heritage dating back to 1852, is a national historic site. Explore the century-old arch stone and brick cellars. Sample fine wines produced from a state-grown native and European hybrid grapes. Taste traditional German sausages produced at the smokehouse by third-generation sausage masters. Have lunch on the terrace or in the shade of the grape arbor while listening or dancing to traditional German music. Hermannhof Winery offers the perfect wine country experience. The newest addition to historic Hermann is the Tin Mill Brewing Company. Germans take their beer seriously. The mill beers are proudly crafted in accordance with the German purity law of 1516, the code that has governed beer making in Germany for centuries. Prost. A 15-minute scenic drive south of Hermann takes you to the Swiss Meat and Sausage Company, seven-time Worst Fest Best of Show winner. Currently making more than 75 varieties of smoked sausages and bratwurst, you're invited to taste test these delectable treats before you purchase. All of the meats are handcrafted with uncompromising devotion and cured and smoked the traditional German way. Don't miss this stop on your visit to Hermann. Much of downtown Herman is a lovely historic district with unique shops where 19th century buildings hug the sidewalk as they do in Germany. Herman history is on display at the historic Herman Museum rooms in the German school, and tours are conducted daily at the Deutschheim historic site. Music has always been an important part of community life. One of the first things the early German settlers did was organize a band. Today, the tradition continues with frequent concerts by the Herman Community Band and others at the town amphitheater. The people of Hermann look forward to welcoming you to their beautiful town. Willkommen. <laughs>